All right, so the bridge is moving. Gonna get out there and cross it. What the fuck is that? Harmony second part. What the fuck is that? Uh. Okay. What um? How much ammo do I have? Seven bullets. I don't know what the fuck Harmony Second Part means. Oh, it must be for a symbol. Ah. <clears throat> for a shadow symbol. Bridge is down. Let's cross it. See what the hell's over here. Abandoned truck. Ketchum Street. House we could go in. This sealed off. Let's go in this house. Pick up what? Piece of wood. door. <clears throat> now we got a broom. Frying pan. Why is there a frying pan in the fridge? <clears throat> Last time I checked, you don't store those in the fridge. Just saying. <clears throat> Wait. What's wrong with this picture? Something change. Oh, the lamp's on in the picture. Okay. What was that noise? The dresser drawer's open in the in the mirror. Look at this. Whoa. Well, obviously the TV just turned on. Something just happened. What was that? Oh wait, the, the the picture. Yeah. <clears throat> ah, the candle. See the candle? Holy shit! That was the whole thing? Complete a mirror mirror side quest. Oh, that was pretty cool. That was quick, but fun. Okay, what we got in here? First aid. Mm -hmm. 
That's it? Two first aid? What else is that? Pistol bullets. More pistol bullets. Wow. Awesome. Two first aid and two pistol bullets. And someone on the floor. Sweet. All right. Uh, shh. The patient is young, a young Caucasian woman, age 20, of good physical health with no abnormalities in her medical or mental health history. She initially came to my office after a recommendation from her family doctor complaining of insomnia, exhaustion, and depression. Subject recently lost a sibling, older sister, but refused to divulge further details. After further interviews, I've diagnosed the patient and suffering from acute obsessive compulsive disorder. Patient describes recurring nightmares, anxiety, fits of anger, and panic attacks stemming from the irrational belief that if she does not conduct mundane, repetitive rituals around her home, the people in the mirror will cause her physical harm. Sending recommendation to the patient's GP that she is suffering, I guess that's a general physician, that she's suffering from OCD along with possible schizophrenia, advising further tests and possible antipsychotic medication. Huh. So that's how it ties into the whole... Oh, God, she's dead. Wait a minute. It's just a shadow. That's crazy! Check that out! It's a shadow on the wall. And she ain't really in the room. That's fucking nuts, dude. A shadow of her hanging on the wall, but she ain't really in the room. That's fucking crazy. So apparently she killed herself. But that was her story. That side quest was her story. That was fucking cool. Alright. <clears throat> Anything else in this house? <clears throat> no. Alright, that was all. That was it. A side quest there. Some neat stuff in this game. That was a neat side quest. <laughs> okay. This side seems to be nothing. What do we have over here? We'll pick up what? A piece of wood. Fuck that. I don't need a piece of wood. Port district. Here's the marina, it looks like. This is probably the way to teleport. Yep. <clears throat> I'm not even going to bother going down there. Because <clears throat> I never unlocked it. What do we have over here? Bricks. A dock. There's a boat. I think that's the boat I need to go on. Or one of those. I see a couple boats. Oh, here's one of those stupid birds. Of course, I can't do this quest now because I didn't... Oh, God. I tried to free that bird at the beginning of the game and it didn't work. It's so weird that sometimes the stuff doesn't work properly, you know? <clears throat> well, never going to complete that quest. Because I ain't going back. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll head down and see what these boats are. One of these boats got to be the right one. Can't seem to get to that one. Maybe it's this one that's docked. Probably this one. There it is. All right, cool. 